Hi everyone, it's Andrea. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to do a flip through of another one of the new Jade Summer books. This one is called Gothic Tattoos. Um, so this is the front cover and the back cover gives you um, an indication of what is inside. Let me just straighten this up so it's actually straight when we look through it. So let's have a look. So yeah, uh, I like anything gothic to be honest. So I thought, let's have a look. So there is of course, I just got bend the spine a bit, this one's a bit different. Um, the cover page, um, lots of skulls. Now okay, see, they've started putting on this side uh, the title and image one first set and on the side just so you can see it they've actually got the title of the book they never use the title of the book on the side that's going to make life a lot easier when you put it on a shelf and you particularly want a book um, and you, then you don't have to flip through all the books to find it so I think what I'll probably do is when I sort my Jade Summer collection out next time is I'll put all the ones with titles on the spine in one section and then everything else separately so it might make life a bit easier but that's I think that's a great idea and thanks to Jade Summer for doing that it does make life a lot easier this one I really love, the cross and the rose. I love this. I think this is stunning. And then we got a coffin with a house inside it and the cemetery, or a church inside it and the cemetery. A skull in a bottle. I like that one. I'm not sure I'd want that on my back, but uh, yeah, that's a, a sort of demony, devilly thing. Magic, that's quite a nice one, I like that one. Skull, oh I love the way the candles are melting into the skull, that's awesome. Oh that's nice as well, that's nice. Mm. These are really good. It'd be better if they were in grayscale. Ooh, I like the moon. I could see me... I mean, I know you wouldn't have a glittery tattoo, but I could see me still colouring them in glitter gel pens or something like that, because that's me. Ooh, uh, he's a bit creepy, isn't he? I like it, though. I like this book. Cemetery. OK, that is an eye and a flower. That's cool. These are really good. I like these ones. I hope you're enjoying this, this set of um, images. I mean, and they're not for everybody, granted, and, and I don't know if I'd colour them all, but some of these I really like. Cat. Skull. Lots of skulls. That makes sense. It's a gothic colouring book. Yeah, I like that one as well. Oh, that's beautiful. The, 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 how they come up with these designs their artists are very talented I know that there's a lot of different artists and they don't get individual recognition but I do I do think their artists are very talented I really come up with this this says 1325 to 1397 it's a grave a mausoleum crypt thing tomb um, there's like a Roman centurion helmet Oh, I like that one. That is clever. It's like I said, I just don't know where they get the ideas for these things from. They're absolutely brilliant. Uh, <laughs> I like that. Oh, look at that. I mean, they are stunning. These, these artists are amazing. They are brilliant artists. Oh, I love that one. I do like that one. Yeah, I'm going to be colouring in this one, definitely. And that's back to the beginning already. Wow, is that? No, it's the same set. It's the same it's, it's set. That's the end of the first set. That's the start of the second set, isn't it? Yeah. So again, you get them twice, which is fine. I don't have a problem with that. It means I can colour one set glittery and one set with pencils or markers, if I so wish. Um, so that is Jade Summer Gothic Tattoos. I will leave links below to Amazon UK and US. Um, in the notes below so you can just click on the link and buy it. I'm not an affiliate I don't get anything from it it's just there for your convenience or if you prefer the PDF you can go to the Jade Summer website and there is a link there to the lulu.com page where you can purchase the digital downloads I prefer physical books because it saves me using up ink and paper 
Um, I've got a load of printed up um, images and I've got a load more to print up and I just don't I just don't do them I just do the ones in the books I've got so many books which is a shame so every now and again I think I'm going to do one of my ones anyway that's a story for another day so I hope you've enjoyed this uh, flip through like I said I'll leave links below and join me in the next video and I will see you very very soon bye guys thanks for joining me